Hello everyone and welcome. This is hers with hopefully which is going to be my last for a while Starbound server setup video. Uh, in many of my other videos I've shown you how to set up a server and now it's time to set up a server for the new giraffe build that just came out. And a lot of things have changed from the last one. In which case now um, instead of having a line somewhere around here that's, you know, under server name, it would, it used to say server passwords. Now you have the ability to create accounts. Like right here, under server users. Uh, when you do go through, after that you hit an enter and then you, you will, I'll put the string down in the description, the string right here, and you can create your users. In which case, here I've set up uh, user1, and I have them set up as an admin and a password. Then user2, which is not an admin, and their password as well. So what you'll do is you'll, you'll go through and you'll check everything, make sure that the server port is right, and then you'll create that string where, uh, for server users so that you can make sure you have you don't have unwanted people coming to your server and if you want to know how to do the basic setup I have three other videos that talk about that you'll just have to uh, cut out or just disregard some of the information that I said that has changed like the server passwords to server users which utilizes the account name when you go to log in on multiplayer so after you have your user and password for how many ever users you want, you can change up here, uh, max players eight, you could change that to, well, I'm just going to keep it eight, but I won't go past that because I don't have that many people that would play on my server because it's, it's a private server that me and another friend play on, in which case this is where that would be. And then if you wanted to add other ones, you would just, uh, copy this and then paste and then change and give them their usernames but then you want to come up to the very top where the admin portion comes in uh, allow admin commands yes for the admin allow admin commands from anyone false you don't want anyone else using admin commands other than the admin allow anonymous connections uh, this is where the account comes in. So if you change that to false, that will not allow any, just everyone on your server if you do not want them there. Whereas if that was true, anyone who has the IP address of your server could get in. So we change that to false. Anonymous connections are admin. You keep that as false. And then you can ban IPs, ban UUIDs, and then of course all these other uh, bindings. And then what you'll do is you'll save. And what I have here, <clears throat> excuse me, is when you go to your Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Starbound, and that, uh, excuse me, that file is in Starbound Config. That's the file we were just working in. Now, what you will do is you'll back out and you could go to Win32 and start your Starbound server. Okay, now that I have I actually set my server up, what I showed you just now was on my actual computer. Now I'm on my I was on my server and I set it up. So now what you'll do to get in is I'll show you an example of not being able to get in because we set anonymous connections to false. So I'll just take this character and that's the my home IP and I wouldn't put my, my actual IP in there. This is for a home connection whereas the IP that uh, your friend will be using will be your actual ISP's IP whereas if you have it set from or if you use like no IP to where you can have it um, u.servegame.com or whatever you may have for that. Or you could just give them your IP. But this is for me at home, and I'm going to show you that 
uh, anonymous is anonymous connections are turned off. So when I do this, it says anonymous connections are disallowed. So now what I'll do since I set it up for hers, that would be your account. And then the password I set just for this one is duckies. And you click join server and there you have it. You are now in the server. And it's nighttime and you can't see. But if I wanted to, now I can type in admin, since I have my account set as admin. And now admin privileges have been given to me, and I don't lose health, and I can probably set the time. There is a, I will put a link down to the, to the place where there are some admin commands. I don't even know if it's set time, it could be different. But anyways, thank you for watching my most recent server setup video. I think it's Soothing Giraffe. I'm not sure. I can't remember what it was called. I know it's something. Spirited Giraffe. That's what it's called. Spirited Giraffe. Well, thank you for watching my Spirited Giraffe server setup video where I show you how to set up accounts, set passwords, and not allow anonymous connections. Be sure to hit up any of the other links below, and I will also have the strings that you need to add to the Starbound config in the description. Thanks for watching, and until next time, this is hers. Woo!